guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Kahila or K, and today's video is quite a simple one, okay? So if you saw my past vlog and uh, how much I can knit in a day, you know I've been working on this beanie, and it's a rib beanie. Let me show you what it's looking like. Hold on. All right. This is what it's looking like. It's this beautiful brown yarn called Acorn Stash. It's hand-dyed yarn from Explore Knits, and it is just beautiful. Okay, so beautiful. I have my cake right here in this yarn bowl from Furls, and it's just, it's just great. So I've been knitting today, like just a little bit. And I don't know when when am I posting this video first of all, then I can know how long I can take on this beanie. Okay, I'm gonna be posting this video in like a week from today. So I have a week to finish this beanie. I don't plan on taking a week to finish this beanie. It should only take me a couple of days, but it's been a day so far and I've, I got that much done. So I think I have pretty good progress right now. And yeah, I don't think I have anything else to tell you guys. Do I? No, it's my first rib beanie. Let me show you the other beanie I made before. So I made this beanie out of hand dyed yarn from Red Door Fiber Studio and oh my gosh, this colorway is so cute. It's DK weight yarn. Oh, this is also DK weight yarn, the one I'm currently working on, but this is just all stuck in it. So you can see. It's just all stuck in it, no ribbed anything. And I was just like, let me try and make a ribbed one. Oh, okay, I remember what I was supposed to tell you guys. I am following a free pattern from Pearl Soho. The pattern is called like, it's a watch cap. It's like a watch cap and mittens pattern. It's a free pattern for both, but I'm using the beanie pattern. It's called the watch cap, but it's a beanie. And yeah, okay. Now that's it, and now let's just knit this beanie. Let's chill. Hello guys, so this is what it looks like right now. It's at four and a half inches. I need to be at seven and a half. I'm gonna stop this for now because I have another project I need to work on, but I will continue knitting this hat tomorrow.
Alright guys, so this is currently sitting at 6 inches, like right, right at 6 inches. It's looking so good so far. And now I'm just going to take a little break, work on another project, and then probably come back to this tonight. Depends on how I'm feeling. We shall see. Alright guys, I have placed my stitch markers for the decreases and now it is time to start decreasing to create the crown. Very excited. So I'm currently doing my decreases and this looks so good like can you guys see that you see the decreases leaning this way and it's on every point where the stitch marker is so boom and boom and boom oh my gosh it looks so good okay but yeah so this is what it's looking like and i have like three more rounds of decreases oh you can't see me sorry three more rounds of decreases to do so i might i might finish today 
I will finish today. Okay. Yes. Guys, oh my gosh, I did say I would finish today and I am done. So, reveal. Dun, 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 dun. This is what the hat looks like. This is so freaking cute. So, look at that. Very nice. So, you could wear it like that or you could just wear it like this. And oh my gosh, look at the decreases. My, one of my decreases stretched over here, but you know what? It's okay, okay? It's fine, we're fine. We'll look at this side and it's beautiful. We love it. It looks like I did something intricate and stuff. Nope, I just decreased. Like that's it, that's it. So let me fold it back up. This looks so good. I cannot wait to take pictures of it. Oh my gosh, this yarn, absolutely perfect. This is so pretty. I literally want to do another one. But I think for my next hat, I'll probably do the Oslo hat. Just to try it out. It's a nice little stockinette stitch hat, you know? So I did this one, which looks so good. And yeah, my first ribbed hat. My first, yeah, my first ribbed hat. And it looks so great. I'm so happy at how it turned out, but that's gonna be it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you think down below, and also let me know what you worked on while watching this video. Give this video a big thumbs up, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and click that notification bell because it will notify you whenever I post another video. Also, don't forget to follow me on Instagram because that's where I post like all updates on any projects that I'm working on, and I'll see you guys in the next one.